Hey guys, Coop here. This is going to be a uh, entry for Superfly Fat Guy 859, Mr. Paul. Awesome guy, awesome channel. He's got a uh, subscriber appreciation giveaway going on right now. And he's giving away Smuckatelli beads, which you guys know I love the Smuckatelli stuff. And he's giving away a Zippo lighter. And uh, he doesn't ask for a lot. This thing is open to anyone, anywhere. Uh, he does have a few rules. I'll put all those down below. Uh, he obviously you got to be a subscriber. Uh, as far as I know, he doesn't have an age limit on it. Uh, he does want a video response, and you can't just be one of the people that make video responses just to enter contests. You have to actually have some content in your channel, you know, contributing something to some community on YouTube somewhere. Which, you know, I, I like that. It, it, it keeps it honest. It uh, I know making videos isn't an easy thing to do, but uh, just making videos to enter contests for free stuff to me is, you know, pretty ludicrous. If you're going to put that much energy and time into making videos to enter contests, why not put that same energy into something constructive? Showing somebody or teaching somebody something. Anyway, guys. <clears throat> that's his uh, part of his rules most of his rules all of his rules will be down below and I usually don't enter contests for my friends and uh, I haven't even really decided whether I'm gonna put this one in for VR but I really liked the content he had behind it about one of the main things is he wants to know your fondest memory of your father or a father figure in your life and uh, he gave a pretty uh, he gave a really good <laughs> it, it touched me just put it that way I mean it really got me thinking about my dad and you know a little bit of background on my dad is my real dad mom divorced when I was real small and I was probably seven or eight years old whenever my mom and stepdad got married. And my stepdad, <laughs> he was about as southern as southern can get. I mean, this guy, you, you think of redneck, his picture's by the definition of it in the dictionary. I mean, this guy was redneck through and through. Really quiet, nice guy. And uh, he was the youngest of three. He actually, when his father died, when he was really young, he dropped out of school in the eighth grade. He was the youngest, and he dropped out of school to get a job and help support his family and send his brother and sister to school. And that right there in itself was enough, you know, that I, I gained a lot of respect hearing just that. But throughout my life... Uh, He's been a very positive influence on me. The man taught me so much. You know, I, I just, I, I can't even imagine trying to pinpoint one thing that he taught me. But I'd say the most important thing the man taught me was uh, to use what's up here. To use your head. You know, if you don't have the money to go buy something, make it. You know, figure it out. And basically, you guys watching my channel, you see I do a lot of videos on trying to teach people how to make what they need instead of buy what they need. And uh, I attribute most of my channel and the way I think to my dad. My dad, uh, <laughs> he, he was a very smart man. He wasn't very book smart, but in my opinion, he was the smartest and coolest dude out there. I mean, he could fix anything. And I, I just loved him to death for it. And what I learned, you know, and as Paul said, you know, you don't look at those things when you're growing up. You uh, you just kind of blow them off. But when you get older, you look back and you see the things that they've actually done for you. And it's quite amazing, the things I learned from my stepdad. And uh, I lost my stepdad back in 1989, 88. And uh, I've missed him uh, tremendously. And there's not a day go by, you know, goes by that, I'm not out in my shop doing something that I don't think of my stepdad. What would he do? You know, how would he do this? And uh, he's a big driving force in my channel. 
even though he's not here. But uh, that's, you know, my part about my dad. And now we'll move on. Uh, he wants us to give a shout-out to a kick-ass channel. And my shout out is going to be for uh, Lone Woodpecker. I like his channel. He's a, an outdoors guy. Does a lot of bushcraft stuff, knife reviews, paracord stuff. Uh, he's out in the wild, out into the uh, the the bush a lot. And uh, I love channels like that that give back and teach people things. It's just it's it's awesome. It's a really awesome way to uh, show people, teach people. So I urge everybody, go over and check him out, Lone Woodpecker. I can't believe that he's only got 200 plus subscribers. He's got such great content. Uh, you guys go over and check him out. Tell him Coop sent you. All right, Paul. I hope this is what you wanted, buddy. Uh, thank you for the contest or the giveaway. Uh, very gracious of you. I, I love your channel, man. I, I, I don't comment all the time, but I do watch. I just I love everything about your channel. Your your enthusiasm and your drive towards your channel to make people feel good draws me to your channel. All right, guys. This is my entry. Anybody want to put their comments and questions down below? I'll be more than happy to answer them. I appreciate your support. I appreciate you watching my channel. It means a lot to me. You guys know we got the Facebook page up and going now. If you want to go over and hit the like button, feel free. If you don't like what you see, you just wasted a couple minutes of your time. With all that being said, my friends, this one's for you, Mr. Paul. Old Coop's going to say, Coop out.